This is Yvette from SharkPoint. SharkPoint Connect enables you to easily incorporate content from other sources into your intranet page. You can establish a connection with useful resources and automatically retrieve content to display on your page. In this tutorial, I will guide you on how to connect to SharePoint News using SharePoint. You will learn how to select the appropriate connection type, complete the setup process, and map the content to display updated news on your page. With SharePoint, you may have news posts and news links that are important to highlight on your intranet. To display these news items on your page, you can use SharePoint Connect. SharePoint Connect is available in almost all design elements, including this slideshow design element in our template. You can easily edit this element and configure it to show news from your site. First, switch to the Grid Mode Editor and open the Slideshow Settings window. Then go to the Connect tab where you can choose from different connection types. For our project, we will use Site News, which allows us to pull news from our current site. If you wanted to pull news from a specific hub site, you could use Hub News. Alternatively, you could use Org News to pull news from all sites across your SharePoint tenancy. Now you need to provide some information to set up the connection. First, select the source of your news. You can choose to pull news from the current site collection, other sites, or a specific SharePoint site URL. Depending on your selection, additional fields may be required. In our case, we will select Current Site Collection and choose to show news from the main page only. You can also set the number of items to display to 5. There are other connection settings that you can configure, but for now, we can keep them at their default values. Once you have provided the required information, you can hit the Connect button to establish the connection. You are now connected to your news source and you can display the news on your page. To indicate what types of information you want to display on the slideshow, you need to go to the Items tab. First, you should delete any placeholder content in the Items tab fields. Then, you can click the pin icon to see the property options you can choose from. When news content is pulled from the source, it comes with several content properties. You can select which of these properties you want to show on your page. Let's display the news title, select a larger resolution for the news image, include a hyperlink to the news article, add text for the link, and have it open in a new window. Once you have selected the desired properties, you can preview how your content will look on the slideshow. Finally, you can hit the Update button and your slideshow will display news from your site. It's worth noting that you only need to establish the connection once. After that, SharePoint will automatically retrieve and update any new news posts or links added to your site in the background. Congratulations! You have just learned how to use SharePoint Connect to pull and display updated news content from your SharePoint site on your intranet page. Thank you for watching!